Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show y'all three of my favorite red lipsticks. I think these lipsticks really complement dark skin. So if you guys are interested in seeing how um, they look on me, keep on watching. The first one I have is by MAC. It's called Ruby Woo. Ruby Woo. And this is a matte lipstick. What I do first with Ruby Woo, I normally just put it on my lips and then I use a lip liner to shape the lipstick, if that makes any sense. <laughs> Okay, so here's Ruby Woo. I can't say that. Here is Ruby Woo without a lip liner. And I'm gonna show you guys with the lip liner I normally use with Ruby Woo, which is by MAC and I'm almost out of it, but it is called Night Moth. And I normally just lightly line my lips with this. Let me get a little closer so y'all can see. I really don't need a lip liner. So I'm just going to lightly line my lips around the red because I don't want to take away from the red, but I want to make it, I want to tone it down a little bit. So here it is with the lip liner. What do you guys think? So it didn't take away. I like it. I think I liked it before a little better though, but that's it. The next one we're gonna try is this one by Fenty Beauty. It's called Stunna Lip Paint. This one is a really bright red. It's very, it's a really loud color for me, but I like it, especially in pictures. So let me go ahead and apply that. I'm going to put on my lip liner, MAC. I'm going to put on this MAC lip liner by Night Moth again before I apply the red. Okay, so I got my lip liner on just to really like tone it down. I really love the formula of this though, it's really smooth. See how red it is already? It's not dry yet. <laughs> the Stunna Lip Paint in the shade Uncensored. It's really, really bold. I love the formula of this lipstick. This has to be worn. I would really wear this maybe on New Year's or even Christmas, like if I just wanted the extra. I want to attract a lot of attention and I want my lips to pop. I would wear this with actually the look I have on right now, no eyeshadow, just a natural beat with like a bold lip because I love how this looks. It stands out by itself, like it's popping. And I normally don't um, like bold lipsticks, but I feel like this one gets a pass because it's not too much, especially with a lip liner. Okay, last but not least, we have Sin. Sin is from MAC as well. Um, this is more on, this is more on the burgundy side, you guys, but it still passes for red. Let me show you guys how it looks. Mm 
Okay, it kind of looks burgundy on camera, but I promise you, well, yeah, I guess this could really pass for burgundy. It's like, yeah, it's like in between. But you guys, if you are not comfortable wearing like a bright red, I think this color really suits dark skin as well. It's not like super dark, like it's not on the burgundy side yet. It's borderline burgundy, but it's still kind of red because in person it does look red. I think sin is the perfect color and this is more of like a soft matte I wouldn't say it's like a matte matte it's easier to put on than Ruby Woo because Ruby Woo is super matte but this one is a little easier to put on and actually has a shine to it as well let me show you guys oh, the sun is messing it up But yeah, it has a shine to it as well. So that's my favorite three. But that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know what you guys think down below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And let me know what y'all's favorite red lipsticks are and which ones I should try because I'm always open to like buying and trying new red lipsticks. You know, that'll look good on me. Bye, guys.